Hi and welcome to my channel, my name is Olivia, you may also know me as the carnivore ballerina and in today's video I will be sharing my skincare routine. Um, skin and healing my skin has uh, been a very huge part of my life, um, very recently of course, well yeah kind of, <laughs> um, and I had to learn through trial and error what to do uh, topically to actually heal my skin. So this is what I'm doing now. Originally I was using normal face washes and things and recently I didn't realize how susceptible or I guess um, sensible I was to larger cities, different environments, and that really impacted my skin health. So I went straight to anything that is ingestible, I will put on my skin. And I, I, I believe in that. That seems to work the absolute best. Um, that as well as using certain different things. So yeah, I will get into um, different face washes and things and what you should look out for in those products at another time. But for today, this is my skincare routine. Of course, this alone does not heal your skin truly. I do believe there's a huge gut. Well, it is proven scientifically as well. Um, I've read over 50 papers now on that, so it is proven. There is a gut and skin connection. So if you have gut issues, that is most likely what's causing your um, skin issues. So clear that. This clears. You do also need to heal it topically, of course. As you can see, I still have some scarring going on. Um, so you do need to also peel those and uh, yeah, I'm rambling on but I do want to mention uh, The sponsor of this video is Clara and Fritz tallow, which is very uh, fitting It is a tallow bomb and I'm currently using them and it has been my favorite. It is not overly greasy I used to make my own and it was just way too greasy I did not like it at all So it's not greasy as well as they have lip balm and I will say this is my favorite product is the peppermint lip balm Of course, I love the other ones too, but why the peppermint one over the orange cream and the plain because as a girl it's nice to have redder lips and this gives like just enough sting to make your lips redder plus shiny uh, and I can I can demonstrate lovely <laughs> if you go to Clara and Fritz um, the link will be in the description. You can co use code ballerina for 10% off any purchase. And if you want to use Bitcoin, you can pay with Bitcoin as well, which is very cool. So without any further ado, here is my skincare routine currently. My morning skincare routine consists of a very, very simple routine. Um, it's just washing my face with cold water. Cold water because it kind of wakes me up in the morning and reduces any redness and puffiness that I may have from the night before if I slept on my stomach face down like some crazy person. Um, I'm just washing off this bentonite clay mask, which I wear almost every single night, and that's all that's on my face. That's all that I need to wash off. I want to highlight, don't scrape your face with a towel. Uh, anyways, this is what it looks like. The right side is a bit worse than the left side. It's just these red under it flat dots which is just painful anyways i'm spraying my face with colloidal silver i spray it around two to three times and then i use this tallow cream with um honey because it's not quite as greasy i've learned through uh buying different brands as well as making my own adding some honey or buying one with honey it's not as greasy i just i can't stand the greasiness anyways i'm just putting more on my face here <laughs> So yeah, water, colloidal silver, and then this tallow cream, and that's it for the morning. Uh, in the evening, it is slightly different because I do wear a bit of makeup. I do not cake my face on with foundation. I made this mixture of face wash, which I will, that's a secret for now. The results are in though. It's been over a month of me using it, and it's my favorite face wash so far. So I will be sharing that secret soon. And it's just this paste um, that I'm making. It's in powder form just because I was traveling at the time. You can clearly see I'm in it. Yeah. Um, it's just easier to travel with powder than liquid because somehow it always spills. Anyways, uh, yeah, so I'm just washing my face off. And this actually, I will probably talk about this at some other point. It will wipe or for the most part clean off any makeup that you may be wearing. If you're wearing an inch thick of makeup, it won't wash it off so yeah but that's what I'm doing I'm just washing my face with this top secret face wash uh, once again cool water and once again I dab my face with a towel a clean towel I always use a clean towel and you never scrape the water off your face because that's just irritating your skin even more that's a tip that's a very useful tip once again I spray my face with colloidal silver I will get into why I do that at some other point in time. For now, you can just think of it as the miracle 
maker um and then i use the same cream as in the morning and then that is about it if i want to peel away at acne scars i'll wait for this to dry on my face and set in for about 20 minutes and then i'll make this bentonite clay mask and the bentonite clay mask is just clean water with bentonite clay and i wait for that to dry on my face before i go to sleep if not then it would just be a mess uh, and if it's a thin mask, it does not really dust off your face so badly. So it won't be a mess in the morning. Uh, and yeah, that is my skincare routine as of now. You will await the top secret face wash and uh, colloidal silver info. So yeah. Thank you for watching. Um, stay tuned as I will have a video if you don't want to use raw products it seems a bit out there i know it, it did for me in the beginning i thought what in the world am i doing using this on my face um but if you don't want to use that i do have an amazon list as well which will be linked down below with um products that i have personally used as well as i overly examined the ingredient list so it is safe of course um you could personally be allergic to certain things so that's the, that's the disclaimer, but if you want to use, let's say, like a more conventional skincare product, you can go and check down below. Um, I have read thoroughly all the ingredients, and I must say, it took a very long time to find um, skincare products that don't contain a bunch of billions of different things, and that's the one thing I love about the Claire and Fritz towel. You can actually read aloud the ingredients. You don't have to look at it and just wonder in awe how that name was created. But so, yeah, if you do want to use normal skincare, you can check down below, as I have thoroughly read the ingredients so they should be fine once again personally it is always changing how you react to certain ingredients and all that fun stuff so i hope this was um informative i will also be making a video at another point on how to actually read the labels what you should watch out for also the concentration levels of um how to read what the concentration levels are it's very simple very straightforward i will get into that Anyways, so until then, thank you for watching. If you want to coach with me, you can find me online at Nutrition Hackers. If you want to message me for anything, you can find me online. All my stuff is linked down below. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I hope this was informative or helpful. Yeah.